Welcome to Slander News, where we give you the whole truth, the half truth, or we just make it up. Today's top stories will include the hardware special. You know what I'm talking about. The banging, the hammering, the screwing, the plowing, the nailing. Don't forget about that word. As one of our top stories, we're going to bring you information on the Jedi Order scandal. It turns out that the Jedi have been up to their old tricks again. It turns out they've been forcing their Padawans. And it turns out they've also been forcing their enemies. We tried to reach out to the Jedi Order, but we haven't been able to contact them or reach anyone. At least, I don't think we did. Did, did we? I don't, I can't remember. Well, we can get back to that later. Okay. So following up on a developing story, we just learned the reason of why Superman went on that murderous rampage last week in the city of Metropolis. It's been found out that through a leaked sex tape, Superman's longtime best friend, Batman, has been having sexual relationships with Lois Lane behind Superman's back. Superman was heard saying things such as, he can't do it like I can while he was murdering innocents in the streets. Based on the tapes that Slander has seen, Batman be slinging it. The mercenary that we're going to feature today for Mercs for Money is none other than Deadpool. Now, Deadpool is a mercenary that you can definitely count on. Someone that you can trust to get the job done. Someone who takes his job very seriously. I mean, he always hits his mark. He does exactly what he's supposed to do, and he delivers in a timely manner. Who else can you count on besides a guy known as Deadpool? So again, if there's someone that you want to take out, who you just can't stand, well, we suggest you call Deadpool. He'll get the job done for you. Hi there, it's Augustus Lancaster here reporting live for late breaking news for Slander News. We're heading down to Crime Alley where Sylvester, wait, I hear no, I get word that we're reporting live for the Wayne Lane sex scandal. Sylvester, what's going on? I'm live in the narrows of Gotham City's Crime Alley. We just found the witness to the Bruce Wayne, Lois Lane hookup scandal. I'm gonna go interview him right now. Sir? Hey, man, what the cameras for, bro? Sir, what, what the cameras for, man? Calm, hey, calm. shut them cameras off, man. Sir, I'm here with the news. I just want to interview you. I don't about give a fuck about the news, bro. I just want to interview you about the Bruce Wayne, Lois Lane hookup scandal. Oh, shit, man. Hey, hey, motherfucker. Hey, look. Hey, man, that shit was crazy, bro. Look, I heard that Lois Lane, she was looking for some real dick, man, and she called Bruce Wayne. So all of a sudden, the bat signal went in the air, man. And next thing you know, he shows up in a Batmobile, man. And he was in full regalia, man. And he just, he shot his gun up there. And he went to a window, man. And then I heard he started just plugging it. Took off his utility belt. And all of a sudden, he was like, splat, skeet. You just saw all these words, man, all over the place, man. It was just everywhere, man. Hey, all I know is that Superman came home the next day. And he was crying, man. He was crying like a little bitch, man. I couldn't even believe that shit, but then again, I can't, because he's flying around in a blue and red suit, man, looking like a, like a Boy Scout, man. I don't know, man. Did but he say anything to Lois? He, he was asking her, what's, what's wrong, Lois? This dick ain't good enough for you? She said, no, it's too small. You ain't hitting it right. And so he just started crying, just started bitching and everything. He started knocking buildings together because he was mad. But, you know, what you gonna do? She got that Bruce Wayne dick. She got that Batman dick, man. Man, I ain't scared of no bitch ass Superman, man. I ain't scared of him. He, this is rap and tap. Man, I'm a soldier out here, man. I'll slap him in the face, man. I'll slap him in the face with my dick, man. You know what I'm saying out here? Hey, hey, man. I'll slap him in the face with some kryptonite. How you gonna be afraid of a green rock, man? How you gonna get weak off of a green rock? What the fuck is that, man? I sell green out here all the time. You gonna get weak off of that? That's all I'm saying, bro. That's all I'm saying, man. 
Thanks for joining us at Slander News. And before we head off, don't forget to cast your ballot for the upcoming primary elections for Luthor and Romney. They're really counting on you. Reminds me of the year Bush and Palatine ran. Those were some dark times. Mm-hmm.